So since I got my U short bow yesterday from that medium clue, I can do Temple of Ikov. I also just made a Bullseye Lantern, so I can probably get Lunar Diplomacy and Desert Treasure done today. I'm gonna try to, no promises, but I think I can make it happen. I love how during Temple of Ikov you see her and you just walk up and you're like, Hey, I got you some Limport roots, even though we've never spoken before. So just strange. I'm I'm not immersed. Haha, <laughs> sit. Get fucked, idiot. There's Temple of Ikov done. Up next is Desert Treasure. And here we go. It's time to hunt down some treasure from the desert. <laughs> Couple of diamonds. Hell yeah, dude. I'm actually pumped for this. Tome of Water, BTW. Alright, you dead. Hell yeah, got the smoke diamond. Let's go. Alright, it's time for the hardest part of the quest. I'm 99 thieving, how can I fail this? There we go. Sick. Got the thing. Okay. Yeah, I'm trying to train runecrafting on my main. Stop. Yes, yeah, sit. Alright, we're halfway there. Alright, it's time to smash a vampire's ass. Alright, come on, I only have one food left and he only has 24 HP left. Come on. Die, you son of a bitch. What the fuck? Please, thank you. Oh my god. Had to run and grab some red spider's eggs because I'm going to make a few extra super restores just so that I know I'm 100% prepared for the ice area. Just boost up with a botanical pie and make these bad boys. Man, I completely forgot that I'm on a troll's slayer task, so I've been getting slayer XP for these guys too. That's kind of funny. You dead, mate. Oh, he gave me some cake. I got that cake, boy. How do I slip and fall when I'm not <laughs> moving? Oh my god. <laughs> Need to get some agility levels, bro. Hell yeah. Time to, uh, time to go to the temple. And it is time to begin the descent through the pyramid. Oh my god, finally! Finally! I failed the pyramid trap things like five times. I had to go bank and everything. It was terrible. But that's Desert Treasure 1 completed. I can use Ancients. Now I gotta go do Lunar Diplomacy and I have 154 quest points. So now that I've started Lunar Diplomacy and got access to Moon Clan Isle, I now have access to the best magic shop in the game. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. All right. There's Lunar Diplomacy completed. Now I've got Ancients and Lunar Magics unlocked. I think now it's time to go do Fremenic Isles, and that's 156 quest points. And after Fremenic Isles, I will be doing the rest of the Recipe for Disaster subquest. So let's fucking go. All right, there's Fremenic Isles done. Now I'm going to go do the rest of the RFD subquests and finish up whatever else I need to get to 176 quest points and get my Borrows Gloves. All right, guys, it's time for my first bit of hardcore endgame PVM on this account. First up, we got to go to the Bandit Camp. Yo, we got it! Hell yeah! Hell yeah, dude! Oh man, ain't that nice? Ain't that nice right there? Too bad I don't have the range level for it, but I only need 21k XP. So yesterday I went and got my Rune Defender and got 60 defense in the process, so I figure why not go ahead and go for Dragon. Uh, hopefully I get spooned. I got mega spooned on the way from Bronze to Rune, so we'll see how this goes. Ooh, let's go, dude. Hell yeah. Let's see. I got my Dragon Defender in 314 kills. Not bad. Okay, so I made the terrible decision of only getting one of these. So if I burn it, I'm just, I'm, I'm gonna fucking cry. Yes, I did it. I didn't burn it. Thank God. <laughs> the Monkey Ambassador is freed. Oh my God. Oh my fuck. What the fuck? 
What? From Limpworts! Oh my god! I'm so spooned! What the fuck? Oh my god. I still- I cannot- I've been sitting here for like three or four minutes now just like in awe. I can't- I just went to get- I just went to collect my herbs, dude. Just- wow. What the f- I can't believe this. I have three pets already, dude. I got- I fucking got the Phoenix pet at, from Winter Tot at like 75 fire making. Five, oh my god, I can't put my words together. I rolled Rocky twice, and now I get Tangle Root at 71 farming. Alright, well I just got a medium clue from that birdhouse run, so uh... <laughs> considering my luck today, I... I Let's see if I get ranger boots right now, too. <laughs> Fuck it. Alright, let's see. Holy sandals? Dude, we take those. What? <laughs> what? Oh my god. Dude, this is nuts. Oh my god. I could, I'm i so pumped right now. What the fuck? Uh, okay, so... Now that the excitement's over with, I need to go get ready for work, and I'm gonna do some AFK shit while I'm there, and then tonight it'll be back to our regularly scheduled programming, gonna do RFD. But, can we just talk about the spoonery real quick? This morning, I woke up, made my coffee, went to Crazy Archaeologist and got my rune crossbow, then I went and finished Dragon Defender, and then I got Tangle Root, and then got Holy Sandals on my ninth medium treasure trail. That's just nuts. That I cannot believe this shit today. Like, that's just... I can't believe it. This is crazy. Anyways, see you guys later. Alright, so last night I did Evil Dave RFD on mobile, and then finished up all the free-to-play quests and Sheep Herder for Morning's End Part 1 and 2, and that put me at 172 quest points. And while me and the gang were sending some raids last night, I parked the account at Sand Crabs and got 70 strength, and I'm about to go free Ceramic Vars. Alright, Mr. White Knight is freed. I have 173 quest points, and he can go back to watching Amaranth streams. You know, the fact that this key is called Innocent Looking Key makes me think it's not innocent. Whoa, what the fuck was that? It's time to kill this bad boy. And then that's two quest points needed for RFD. And a Mauritania heart requirement. Can I walk, please? What the fuck? Oh, look, Tangle Root pushing the cart. <laughs> Nice. And there's Haunted Mine completed. I now have access to Tarn's Lair. That's two quest points to put me at 175 to go in the Colonel Romancer's portal. And a Mauritania Hard Diary requirement. Let's go get these Borrows gloves. I'm so pumped, dude. This is sick. I've been working on this for a while now. It's time. Kill. Kill. Okay, so I'm gonna try to mage the Cullen Romancer, because it's been it's been doing really well for me so far. So uh, we'll just see how it goes though. If I have to tell you out, I have to tell you out. I got the one click ring of dueling, so we're good. We're chilling. He's trying to melee me right now. That's why I've been trying. That's why I'm doing this so that when he goes to try to melee me, he can't get to me, and then it's literally just free, dude. <laughs> oh my god! He only hit me with his range or mage attack like once. And there it is. It's fucking game over. Mm-hmm. Blah. Get fucked. And that's Recipe for Disaster completed. Let's go, dude. Let's go. With Recipe for Disaster completed and the Culino Romancer defeated, that marks the end of the early game for us on this wonderful hardcore Iron Man series. We've made a few friends along the way, like my boy Tangle Root here. We got 99 Thieving and Fire Making. Got 80 Hunter for Amulets of Glory. And... Many other big upgrades, unlocked ancient magics and lunars, all that good stuff. So now we're ready f to get into the real content, doing the Slayer grind, getting into Barrows, doing construction and grinding for Song of the Elves, stuff like that. I've had a lot of fun making these videos, and I really appreciate you guys watching them. It's been a lot of late nights and early mornings 
thank you guys for watching. I realize I'm talking about it like it's kind of the end of the series, but... I think we're just getting started.